You've heard of Elf on a Shelf. Now get ready for it. You guys are trying to, you know, it's a trap. There's a trap. You've heard about Elf on a Shelf. Now here's Lily on 12 Milli. So today, we are going to be showing you a bunch of memes that all stem from a traditional Christmas tradition that has gone viral recently. Okay, no clue whatsoever. <laughs> Christmas tradition? In, in September? I'm Jewish, so I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Elf on the shelf. Elf on the shelf, yeah! This is the Elf on the shelf meme. Okay, I've never seen it. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm all in on this. It's got know. a meme now? Yes! Elf on a meme? So here's a meme that people say may have been the first one to do this. You heard of Elf on a Shelf, now get ready for Ash in the Trash. Ash in the Trash. Ash in the Trash! Ash in the Trash, yes! So it's things that rhyme? It's turkey it's, on a jerky? It's a thing that rhymes on another thing. Is this a thing? Oh my god, is this something I'm not gonna understand like fidget spinners? I've never heard of the saying, but I think I understand the idea of rhyming moderately well, so I'm I'm in. So this first one was actually created in 2016, but wasn't until a few weeks ago when this started to gain popularity on Reddit, and now it's everywhere. So we have some more to show you now. You ever heard of Elf on a Shelf? Nah, man, it's all about Shrek. <laughs> See, this is gonna be one of those things where like, it's stupid, but I'm gonna laugh at every single one of them. Nah, man, it's all about Shrek on the deck. This is turning me into a rapper, I think. Oh, Shrek, Shrek on, on the, the deck. deck. Yeah, Shrek on the deck. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I just laughed. Something's working here. Is this like the new meme that's like blowing up? Yeah, it's very funny. simple. I feel, I feel like people are amused so easily now. Shrek on a deck! Yes! I get really excited about this meme. I don't know why I like it. <laughs> it it's just you've a heard bunch of, of rhyming things. Oh my girl. You've heard of Elf on a Shelf, now get ready for Peach on a beach. You've heard of Elf on a Shelf, now get ready for Peach on the beach. I want like the Thug Life sunglasses to come down over my eyes like, should we just be zinging these out as soon as we see the image? <laughs> I can't help it. Okay, as it's fast like as we can get, we're in a race with each solving other. Solving a riddle. Part of the cleverness of this meme though is that sometimes it takes a little thinking to be like, what is this and how do I, like how do I work it into the context of the meme? You all know Elf on a Shelf, but now it's time for Tide on a Slide. Mm, all right, all right. Tied on the slide. See, perfect Ooh, example. You beat me to it. You beat me to that one. Now it's time for tied on the slide. <laughs> <laughs> this is like uh, this is like more dad jokes. It's cute, but like I've seen better memes. I feel my meme standards are a little higher, a little too on the nose. They're all on the nose. I have never seen so so many puns in a Twitter account than yours. I love puns. I cannot believe you're not on board with this meme. This meme screams you. It does. Maybe I'm just jealous that I've missed out on it. You've heard of Elf on a Shelf, now get ready for Bane on the Plane. You heard of Elf on a Shelf, now get ready for Bane, Bane on, on the, the plane. plane. Isn't that Bane? Bane on a Plane! I got it. Oh my god, am I like a lame person that's out of touch? I wasn't a Batman fan, I'm more of a Spider-Man. Stan. If I saw Bane on a plane, I'm sorry, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm taking the next one. <laughs> That's just a clip from the movie, so. Yeah? You know, I like the ones where they're actually doing the Photoshop, the super imposition. I don't know, I like the simplicity of just the screenshot. That one is, is amusing. It does require something, you need to know the context of the movie though. Right? Like that one's a bit tricky. And that's what makes it fun. It's like a little inside joke in every rhyme. You've seen Elf on a Shelf? Now get ready for Drake. On a steak! Drake on a steak. <laughs> <laughs> a rare steak. That's hilarious. <laughs> I love me some Drake, and I, and I love me some steak too. Why have I never seen any of these? Am I asleep? It's almost as if this is some fictional, you know, home shopping network. Like, you're familiar with the one product, now, Drake on a steak. You've heard of Elf on a Shelf. Now get ready for it. You guys are trying to, you know, it's a trap. There's a trap. You've heard of Elf on a Shelf. Now get ready for The Rock on the Cock. There's a cock, is that what this is? Is the rock on a cock? Rock on a cock. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's dirty. No. I wasn't gonna say it, but you said it. This one takes a Christmas, like a Christmas rhyme, and turns it a little bit dirty, and I'm like, oh, you shouldn't do that. 
It's, it's the magic of Christmas. You heard of Elf on the Shelf. Now get ready for RuPaul on the U-Haul. Oh my God, that's the best one. RuPaul on a U-Haul. <laughs> okay, I stand that one. I stand this meme now. I love this one. You've heard of Elf on the Shelf. Now get ready for RuPaul on a U-Haul. This is funny now. He's doing the Photoshop. Yeah. If a rapper put all of these rhymes in a rap song, I mean, I think it'd go platinum, man. You know, I feel like I'm gonna steal this and I'm gonna drop a mixtape. Tonight. I enjoy it. I'm just gonna say, some of these have made me laugh. Our friend Sean was just moments ago telling us how annoying these were. But hey, I'm having fun. I don't it's know. It's stupid. Oh, that's good. You've heard of Elf on the Shelf, now get ready for Ed Sheeran on Helen Mirren. You know, actually, now that I say it out loud, there's one too many syllables in there. Wait, is that Ed Sheeran? On Helen Mirren. Oh, okay. Wow. Too far. Too far. Wow. This is Ed Sheeran Sh on Helen Mirren. She oh. oh. Sheeran on Mirren. Wow. Yeah. We're getting real cerebral with these yeah. creations at this point. The internet is like so weird. I love it. The best you heard of Elf on the Shelf meme yet. Okay. Well, get ready for socks on the floor. Mom, that doesn't even rhyme. Aw. I like when parents try and get involved. Socks on the floor. Doesn't even rhyme. That's good. See, that's good. I like that. That's something my mom would do. Oh, the moms. That's my mom, literally. She, she would text me that. Props to this mom who is up with the hippest of memes. Yeah, this is a cool mom. Well done her. She's not, she not, not only knows the meme, but she's subverting the meme to make fun of her kid. I feel like this is gonna blow over pretty quickly. I don't know, man. Stuff like this stays around like forever. You know what, I'm taking it back. I don't think these are stupid. These are fun. Yeah. It's a puzzle. It's kind of like See? a riddle you gotta solve. That's what I'm saying. It's like a like... mind game. You could yeah. make a whole book of these. Get rid yeah. of the Sudoku and just replace it with Elf on a Shelf Challenge. Yeah. Oh, you know that's already in the works. Our audience did one of me the other day. Wait, and really? And they put it on Twitter. And it, okay, so it was a picture of my face. Yes. And then it was a treble clef symbol underneath it. Steph on a clef! It was Steph on a clef! Oh, that's it was cute! Great. So while some memes are more abstract and hard to understand, Elf on a Shelf memes are very simple and ask you to just rhyme two things. So what do you think about the simplicity of this meme? I think just, People are just getting so easily amused. I like how everyone can participate because it's easy, but I like that memes require a little bit of wittiness. This is a little bit too simple for my liking. I think we should have higher meme standards. I think it works because, you know, kids want to watch the memes, they want to look at the memes, and, you know, you got to make it easy for them to figure out. Simplicity works because it's yeah. all inclusive. Anybody can get in on the elf on the shelf meme now. You don't have to be an Einstein to to get in on this one. The fact that this one is so simple <laughs> is nice. You can make abstract memes for days, but actually making a meme that everyone can participate in is sort of refreshing, actually. And I don't have to go look up where it came from. I can just be like, oh, I know the original reference for once, and I can see it riffed on. And the, the simpler it is, the more creative people can also get with it. It's more rewarding when it's more obscure. For example, like, uh, what was that? Ed Sheeran on a Helen Mirren. You know, there's that sense of you, you, like that sense of reward when you're like, oh, I know who both of those people are. I like that. And one, uh, yeah, that makes you that makes you want to share it because you're like, do you know the pop culture knowledge that I know? Oh, finally. Yes. To end this episode. Yes. You know, we have two very talented graphic designers here, Bryn and Lindsay. Yeah. So to end this episode, we want you to make your own Elf on a Shelf meme. <laughs> <gasps> okay. Okay. I think we should do Matt Pat on a fat cat. You've heard about Elf on a Shelf. Now here's Lily on 12 Millie. You've heard of Elf on the Shelf. Now get ready for Mufasa on Mikasa. Something like that. Esau on a pizza? What? <laughs> Come on. You ever heard of Elf on a Shelf? Well, get ready for Granola bar in the car. Nailed it, that's what I ate this morning. How about, um, like a pimp on a shrimp cocktail? <laughs> pimp, pimp on a shrimp. Pimp on a shrimp. I like that. Mega 64 on a snore. 
okay? And it's, hear me out. It's a sleeping old man snoring, mouth open, and Mega64 is like floating out of, you know, his nostrils. It's kind of symbolic of our video content, <laughs> where kind of where that's headed. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching this episode of YouTubers React. If you like what you saw, subscribe to everybody below. Bye. Bye. See ya. Hey guys, thanks for watching this episode of YouTubers React here at FBE. Subscribe to all the YouTubers down below, right below me. Let us know in the comments what next you'd like to see, and maybe you'll do it. Bye guys.